And the town of Hempstead is working to keep homeowners safe from unlicensed work in their homes. The legislation officials are trying to pass. The news starts now. The town of Hempstead is flushing out unlicensed plumbers and announcing new legislation that will protect homeowners. Five House One's Briella Tomasetti is in Seaford with the story. Hempstead town officials joined by local master plumbers say hiring an unlicensed plumber could be more dangerous than you'd think. It can lead to leaks, mold, and ultimately burn a hole in your wallet. But it goes even further than property damage. It happened recently in New York City where they tried to tie into a natural gas line and it blew up that building completely. Men's lives were lost. It's common for master plumbers to loan their licenses to handymen that are not qualified, who will often do the work at a cheaper price. When that person borrows a master plumber's license, the master plumber is the one who gets the permit and who the inspector sees. But getting qualified for the job isn't easy. Just to apply, you need to have worked under a licensed plumber for at least seven years. Then to receive your license, you have to get an overall score of 75% are a three-part test, which includes a practical exam. The new legislation would penalize a master plumber who signs off on work he hasn't completed, leading to a license suspension or revocation, and even fines of at least $3,000 per offense. We have approximately 740 licensed plumbers now, so there is a large pool for you to choose from so that you make sure that the work that is done is done in a safe manner because, again, it is a matter of life safety. Town Councilwoman Erin King Sweeney says that the board will call a hearing to consider the new legislation on April 10th. And if it does pass, she says she hopes it'll be adopted by other towns and villages across the island. For now, reporting in Seaford, Briella Tomasetti, Fios, One News.